This is another update on the Nexrad weather stations on the duplex weather control. Um, this is Iceland and just in the last 24 hours if you uh, have a look at this just watch how this uh, precipitation is caused when the Nexrad right in the middle of this storm um, it, it's uh, affecting the um, the storm precipitation as it comes through. Yeah let's just play it. Okay, that's coming up. Let's slow it down a bit. There's the next rad, right in the middle. There. And these just aren't circular beams. The next rad are like a dome beam that comes out. They're three dimensional. It's like the uh, the Russian dolls. There's layers within layers within layers. But um, this is how precipitation goes through. And you can see the beams of the circular next rad on the outside circles on the sections. But wow, quite an impact there. And we'll just um, we'll just play it through now. There it goes right in the centre. So where is this baby? And there's some amazing anomaly I'm going to show you with some jet aircraft. Most unusual. I've never seen this before, but I want some opinions. I want people to get back to me on this and tell me what you think. Now, there we go, there's the name of the place, I don't want to try and attempt it, it's Red Janus Beer, um, but next round is easier to say. Right, here we go, on this area here, and there's the little baby, you always see these smack in the middle of these storms. Um, and. To the left there's some funny anomalies here, look like little harp. I'm not sure if they're harp transmitters or something, they're, they're linked with cables on the top. Um, it's probably a small um, ionizer where they, uh, the harp can go up into the, uh, the uh, stratosphere just to do the heating for the radar. But you can see this one very quickly from the road here. I'll just focus down on here. It is. Now, not far off the coast from here, the satellite picture zooms in um, from Google Earth. And I'm going to take you back out from this now. Um, so let's exit Street View and come up. Now, it's almost like a blue beam projection of these two aircraft, if I can find them. Where are they? There's two aircraft that fly across the coast and I think it's down this coast here. There they are. Can somebody explain this to me? That appears to be a real aircraft and yet this one seems a projection. Now, I've measured the dimensions of that and the dimensions don't tally to the aircraft so it's not like a radar reflection or something like that um, it's a different shape and size the tips of the wings the shape of the wings and the shape of the tail doesn't match with the aircraft that's next to it so I don't know if it's a projection or if it's a fluke of some kind but this baby certainly sending something at the back of it um, most unusual um, there it is, let's keep it in the picture so I, I don't know, I can't figure this one out I must admit I'm a bit baffled on this one um, that would appear quite a genuine aircraft this thing's some kind of echo reflection of radar, who knows but um, we do know blue, blue beam exists where you can project 3D images and they look solid but this one looks like it's gone wrong if that's the case um, but it does appear that there is some activity going on with regards to potential chemtrail in there I'll leave that one with you folks